Hey guys, uh, today has come. I'm about to sell this scooter, so I figured, you know what, a better time to now to, than to do a quick overview of it and a review that I've been promising never got to. Uh, so, I, like I said, I'm selling it today. Um, this is the Lance PCH 200i. It's a 200cc scooter. That's what it's classified as, but the CC is actually 169. Uh, it has a GY6 engine in it, or motor, whatever, however you prefer to uh, call that. Uh, it has uh, disc brakes in the front and in the rear. Um, it it's about the same size as a 50cc scooter. It, um, it only has one rear shock. <clears throat> uh, as you saw at the beginning of the video, the exhaust is pretty quiet. It's a pretty quiet scooter. Um, what all do I have to say about this thing? I've owned it for over a year. Uh, I put uh, almost 2,400 miles on it. Um, I drove it all over the place, in the country, in town, uh, the suburbs, everywhere in between. Um, I love the thing uh, while I had it. Uh, like the cons that I didn't like about the scooter, um, the suspension, since it only had that rear shock, it was real bouncy. Um, it bounced me around everywhere, really hard on the body. Um, but what I've noticed, most bikes are like that, so it really has to do with the road you're on, not really the, the bike you're on. I'm sure there's bikes out there that have really, really nice and smooth, um, suspension, but, uh, not in this price range. So this thing, I think I paid, um, around three grand out the door, or I, I think I paid, uh, to 3200 or 32 or 3300 with a helmet so it wasn't too expensive i bought it brand new out of a dealership in deep ellum uh, that's in uh, dallas texas um, the place is called blitz mopeds uh, really cool uh, little shop the owner's really cool too his name's neil um yeah uh that's probably my biggest con about the scooter was the suspension uh, also, at higher speeds, it felt really unstable. Um, I'm talking about like past 60 miles per hour. But I figured, you know, this is a scooter that's built off of a 50cc chassis. So going that fast is going to feel a little gnarly. <clears throat> I added, uh, I did a couple upgrades to the scooter. I added um, that rear rack you see on the back. Uh, and I have I did show a video on that in the past and I have to I attach I would attach a milk crate to it It's a perfect thing to uh, um, Go and pick extra stuff up. I also like the open floorboard um, I did go get gas uh, for my lawnmower uh, a few times and I used a five gallon gas tank and putting that in between my legs um, made it very convenient and I would say that's the first time I ever felt really safe on the scooter is when I had that five gallons of gas because nobody wanted to be around me. Um, the center stand is uh, works great. Uh, it also has a kickstand. It doesn't have any safety features as far as like if you have the kickstand down, you could still start it. Um, in fact, I, I did uh, drive the scooter a few times and noticed like within a, a block or two that I left the, the kickstand down. Um, the pros about this scooter is the size, uh, it's really small, uh, just like I said, like a 50cc scooter, uh, you can park it practically anywhere, nobody tell, told me anything, I'd park it up on sidewalks right outside, uh, grocery stores or any other type of stores I would go and do errands with, uh, nobody ever said anything, they just thought it was a normal thing, <clears throat> so... Yeah, this, per this scooter is perfect for uh, a downtown environment uh, where um, you have limited parking space. Like I said, you could park this anywhere. Another perfect place uh, this would be is if you're a college student on a college campus. Um, you could take it anywhere and 
get to your classes on time and carry your books around or whatever you need to carry with you. I don't know what kids uh, in college carry anymore. Um, yeah, that's really all I wanted to say about the scooter. I, I wished I had a GoPro uh, so I could um, do a, a test drive and show you guys uh, before I s sold it, but unfortunately that's just not in the my funds right now to, to buy a GoPro. In fact, that's what I'm planning to do with the money I make off this scooter. I think I'm going to get me a, a used uh, GoPro Hero 4 Black Edition and then um, start making uh, moto vlogs with my new uh, Yamaha X-Max, which is this bad boy right here. So, um, yeah. Uh, again, that's all I really wanted to say about the scooter. It's a great little, great little scooter, and uh, I don't know. Um, keep watching my videos. Like I said, I'll have future videos about my Yamaha X-Max as I, I do mods to it. And hopefully eventually I'll do start doing motor vlog videos with uh, a GoPro attached to my helmet. And uh, that way you can have more of the experience uh, w about what it's like to own a scooter and drive one around. They're super fun. Like, I really wish they were more popular in America and we could get like really cool scooters like the uh, Honda uh, 80... I think it's the ADX or ADVX uh, and the the 750 model. I know we have they have the 150 model here, uh, and the Honda For the new Honda Forza scooter is also really cool. Um, I would also like to test drive uh, the new Yamaha T Max, but that's not out in America either. So again, uh, stay tuned for more videos like subscribe comment below and i hope you guys uh continue watching my channel um this is just a little side hobby for me right now i'm not taking it too seriously in fact uh i like this type of video format where i don't have to edit anything i'm just gonna slap this right on youtube and not worry about it uh, i have done an oil change on the new uh on the new x max and I, I replaced the mirrors and um there'll be videos posted on that uh, I just have to edit them, and yeah, I'm, I I don't like doing that, and it, it's really a pain to do on the phone since I filmed it with the phone, so I, I need to convert them over to the computer, and I really don't know what editing software I'm going to use, so if anybody wants to post a comment below, like, what they recommend, that'd be great. Again, thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Peace out.